Sherry Rapley thought a temporary shortage of infant formula would be over by the time her daughter was born. That was five months ago. The reality has been that it's actually seeming to get worse and worse, at least from a consumer standpoint. Rapley was only able to secure her brand of regular formula from a friend in the United States. She has not been able to find it in Regina since September. She says other brands are usually more expensive and suddenly switching brands can be hard on babies. She adds that breastfeeding is not a solution for everyone. Some people like myself are nursing, pumping and bottle feeding and now we're also having to go out and scour store shelves for formula and call around and things like that and so it's, it's, it's been a bit of a nightmare for a lot of parents. The infant formula shortage has persisted in various forms for nearly a year. Manufacturing problems and product recalls have made it worse. The Saskatchewan government says the specialty formula shortage is Canada-wide. It says while regular formula is available, some brands may be out of stock. We're uh, in contact with, with the manufacturers and doing what we can, again, within what, uh, what, what abilities we have as government to try to uh, encourage and address the shortages uh, to the best of our abilities. Last week, Hindley said the government is monitoring supply and will try to make sure more arrives in Saskatchewan. He didn't say how. Rapley and others now want the province to investigate what's causing the shortage of regular formula brands. They say manufacturers might not be the only concern. There might be problems in distribution or even changes in the way people are consuming products. That includes panic buying. Rapley and others are now working on a paper petition, which will also urge the province to consider importing more regular brands. Daniela Ponticelli, CBC News, Regina.